In California, 115,000 people were counted as homeless in 2016. Of those, 20,482 were families with children. Chef Bruno saw their need for help and decided to do something about it. In just 12 years, Katarina's Club has fed 2 million meals, housed 131 families, and serves 3,000 kids hot meals every night. With two existing programs, which house and feed families and children, Bruno recently added another program called the Hospitality Program. For the children, is amazing. As a teenager, instead of being on the parking lot, or instead of being on the street or playground, you can have a job. It doesn't matter if you make 200, 300, 500 dollars, but there's always something that you can help yourself or your parents, which I think is a, an amazing thing after Boys Girls Club, but kids can find a job also automatically. In this program, high school students are given the opportunity to learn how to work in the hospitality and culinary arts industry in 12 weeks. Uh, my role and Culinary Lab's role in the Hospitality Academy is to train the students uh, once they get to the culinary portion. So some of the students choose to get into the kitchen, that's their passion, that's what they want to do. We, we get those students and they come to our school, they work in our kitchens and we train them on basic cooking techniques and we help them prepare for the meal that they're going to serve to you know, family and you know, whomever comes to sort of the culmination event for, for the academy. Students are taught the skills that they will use when they cook and serve at the program's graduation ceremony. Like serving actual people was really good. The best part to see those kids in this program is uh, see them when they cook. Remind me when I was 14 years old, I was helping my mom. My first uh, feet in the kitchen, I was 14. A man once said, if you give a man a fish, he'll eat for a day. But if you teach a man how to fish, he'll eat for a lifetime. The hospitality program is the epitome of this quote. I've been a donator now for a couple years. I got involved with it because it, it hit a nerve with me that these kids are going to go from the back of the house to the front of the house and eventually get a job, which is fantastic. After feeding thousands of kids, Bruno and the charity have taught the kids how to provide for themselves. All right now we live in a two-bedroom apartment and me and my brother um, sleep in the same room and I hope that we could um, get a better house or better living and I can help pay for the um, house. This program gives kids the opportunity and qualifications needed to get them jobs with restaurants and hotels to help support themselves or their family's financial needs. This program has, a, has the potential to change a trajectory of life. And you think what that does, that's not just that life, that's that, that person's family, later on their kids, generations. If you, if you have a life going this way and you can turn it this way, to uh, opportunity and goodness and a career as opposed to a dead end. Um, you talk about a, uh, just from an investment point of view, a multiplier, and you know, I think the mentorship more than anything has the ability to change the direction of life. As you know, Chef Bruno has his heart into this whole situation. And if you can donate money, donate your time, um, just think about how you can help these kids. Because if they have a place that they can go to work, if you know someone in the restaurant industry, it'd be fantastic to step up and to help them. When we were younger, my mom separated from my father, and then it was just us for a while, going motel to motel. Um, I was at the point where I'm starting to want to think about college and think about a future, and like all I'm seeing is how hard it is, how you have to struggle, and how, you know, to stay in a house and stuff. Sorry. That's so. It was just like hard to think about how I'm going to get ahead in life. The community can always help. Uh, they see what we do from one kid, we already saw 1.7 million. From one family that we move out, we already moved 130 families. For the kids who graduate of the hospitality, we graduate over 75 kids so far, and we're increasing that. 
Just look at what Katerina Sklar, the community to just step over and say, I want to help, what can I do? Um, that is basically it. Um, I'm really grateful that I got the opportunity to work at this program. It is also an even bigger step towards the goal of no child going hungry.